Simba. Hey, I have another splendid story to tell you guys. So I was driving yesterday, and then all of a sudden, some prick from New York decided to cut me off. <laughs> Fucking emo fuck. So then I sped up, cut his ass off, and then went 20 miles per hour in a 45 while flipping him off all at the same time. Haha, <laughs> fag. So then this guy follows me to the Walgreens parking lot and gets out of his car and tries to fight me. Get out of the car, you little fucker. Let's dance, you Professor Snape-looking bitch. This guy was no taller than Danny DeVito, so I told him to get back in his car, drive to the North Pole because Santa Claus is waiting for him to build toys. He then said the most classic line of all time that I know all of you have heard at least once in your lifetime. What'd you say, bitch? Get out of the car, motherfucker. I'm from New York. I'll kick your ass. Why is it every single time before a person from New York is about to get in a fight, they say, Come on, motherfucker, I'm from New York! Like, all people from New York are descendants of Hercules, and when they come out of their mom's vagina, they're automatically 10th degree black belts in karate. Come on, you gotta get out of the car? And this guy was fake chewing gum. He was fake chewing gum! Since when does it make you a badass to fake chew gum? I know you've seen that too. Did Bruce Lee like fake chew gum before he slayed a damn dragon? I don't think so. So after he announced that he was from New York, I called him a liar, said that he's really from the North Pole, and I told him to stop fake chewing gum because it's not scary. Get out of your car, you little homo. It's going down. What? Santa Claus is coming to town. I said it's fucking going down, you little shit. What? Rudolph is brown? I know that. You're fucking dead, you little shit. His nose is red. I know. So then he got pissed, and then he went to go get a baseball bat from his car, probably a toy that he built for a little kid for Christmas. So then before he could bash my head in with a baseball bat, since he can't use his fist, I said, Hey, I forgive you. Life's too short to be mad at a little person from New York. See ya. Bottom line, if you're from New York, don't announce it before you're about to get in a fight. New York is a state, not some newfound type of karate where you can kill somebody with your pinky. Shit! And don't fake chew gum, you look fucking retarded.